What's going on YouTube? This is 903 Fishing. Today I'm gonna to be white bass fishing and we're gonna see how quickly that we can get a limit. Now look guys, I messed up this morning. Forgot my anchor for the kayak. Had some rain last night, so the creek is actually running a little bit more than it has been. So it's very hard for me to stay still right now. And you know what? I've done put the kayak on the bank and I'm gonna stand right here at this spot. This is the first spot that I've come to and I wanna show you guys something. Check it out. The reason why I have picked this spot right here. Now, there's a bend right here, first off. There's, there's my first thing that I'm looking for, a nice bend. And then we have some slack backflow water right here at my feet. So I would not be surprised if I don't start catching white bass right here, right in front of me, and especially underneath this tree right here. So we have slack water from a bend, okay? and that is a great place to find these white bass i do appreciate y'all for clicking on this video if you haven't go ahead and hit that thumbs up button for me it greatly helps the channel out also we're on the road to 50,000 subscribers if you haven't go ahead and hit that subscribe button come join the family lots of white bass fishing and crappie fishing as well on the channel for 50,000 subscribers i'm going to be giving away a couple acc crappie sticks some slab city jigs and a couple more items so if you want a chance to win some of these items y'all be sure to hit that subscribe button come join the family as soon as we hit 50,000 subscribers there will be more details but let's see if we can't get on these white bass today y'all stay tuned all right guys we're hooked up on our first baby dang it's a big one too oh man yes it is didn't expect that right there hey guys that's a male pretty pretty nice size male let's see if we can go back to back on them typically you can i think there he is right in front of me oh buddy get out of there Oh man, they're so fun. Look at that, guys. Oh, baby. Hey guys, that's a good male right there. They're right in front of me. I'm gonna put these on the bank for now, but then if they're biting like this, it's my first spot I've been to. Let's see if there's another one right here. I dropped my pole in the water earlier. Now my reel doesn't work. So I'm having to, <laughs> I'm having to do the best. I, my, my, my reel won't even reel. See, I, I'm kind of really aggravated at the moment, but I'm gonna kind of try to see if I can overcome that. Cause my reel, it just, it just won't reel. So I <laughs> uh, don't know what to do about that really. So. There he is, though, right off that barge. Oh, man, they're right in front of me, guys. And when I mean right in front of me, I mean they're literally right here. They're right here in the slacker water. There's three. It's almost like I feel like I can just do that can I do that oh there he is again oh 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 we're right in it oh buddy oh that's a big one that's a big and look at that guys that's a big is that a male or a female it's kind of hard to tell that is gonna be a male Okay guys, I'm gonna go ahead and put these in the basket. Haven't seen anybody come up this far yet, so maybe I'll be alone today during this video. Here we go. 
Today I'm sticking with the three inch grub from Yum. Eight ounce jig head, plain head, and that's what we're using to catch these whites. Now, I think they're just gonna be right here in this slack. There he is. Yep. There he is. After I reel this fish in, I'm gonna show y'all something, guys, just real quick. I wanna show you why these white bass are right here in front of me. These are the types of places that I look for. Well, oh, that's a good one. I'll show you why the white bass are in this area right here. That's number five. I do need to keep count. Now look, here's the situation. You got really fast moving current here, okay, out. Now there's a minimal current right here in front of me. These white bass, and there's also a sand barge right here in front of me. See, I know this from fishing here when the water's real low, that there's a sand barge that comes out here and these white bass are in between the sand barge and the bank right here, kind of underneath this tree right here. They're in that slack water. They're probably spawning at the moment. I didn't hit it that time. There he is. That one hit it. Oh, that's so fun. There he is. Ooh, I'm talking about swallowed that three inch grub. Remember guys, Walmart three inch grub, okay? You can get 15 for $1.75. And I don't know why more people don't use them because they work. They work, baby. So that's number six. That's number six. I'm gonna go ahead, just for good measure, I'm gonna go ahead and use this clicker so I don't get lost up. But hey guys, it looks like there's, it looks like they're stacked right here. So let's see how many more we can catch. Oh, baby. Oh, it's so fun. I mean, I haven't, I, I'm not gonna jinx myself. I'm not gonna do it. Look at that, guys. Beautiful, beautiful and so much fun. I mean, fun is all get out. That's seven. There he is. Oh my gosh. Jeez, is that a white bass? Oh, it's a big one. Oh, that's a big one. Oh my gosh, guys. Look at that white bass. Oh, oh my gosh. That is a giant. That's a giant. Guys, let's get a measurement on this one. Oh my gosh. Guys, th this, this is a big fish. Guys, that's a 15, that's a 16 incher. That's a 16 inch white bass. And it's a white bass too, cause he's got one line. Oh my gosh. Wow. 16 inch white bass. Oh my goodness. That is a stud. Is there another one? Oh, yes, there is. Back to back. Oh gosh. There he is. Look at that ACC, guys. There's another big one. Look how much this, oh my gosh. Another good one. There he is. All right, guys, I had to get the hook out of there. Look at that. Dang, guys. That is going to be number nine. Yes, that's number nine. And I've been filming for about 10 minutes, maybe 15. 
Wowza. Let's keep going, guys. Let's see how many more we can get. All right, guys. So today I'm using my six foot two piece. All right. Six foot two piece on these white bass today. And I got the Shimano Sienna 500 right here. Um, six pound mono. Okay. So real pretty light action for these white bass. And like I said, on this end, three inch curly tail white grub from Yum. Plain one eighth ounce jig head. And it's looking like they're there, guys. I'm finding them right here. Oh, they're there. Oh my gosh, what the heck happened? What what happened? I was about to just reel it in. Jeez. <laughs> oh guys, I was not ready for that. My bait came out of the water because I missed a fish. And then look, this one right here just came out of nowhere. That's a 12 incher, guys. That's a 12 inch white bass. Okay, we're in double digits. There he is. Not a very big one. It's still gonna be a keeper though, I think. Oh yeah, for sure. That's a little keeper male. Okay guys, well, there's another one. That's about another 12 inch or so. And that is going to be number 11. There he is. Boy, I slow reeled that right through that little current. It's game over. Oh, nice. Oh, another little, oh, you sucker. Another nice male, it looks like. Put him in there. Well, number 12. Now guys, I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't really eat white bass anymore. And I just, you know, I would rather eat crappie, of course. But I do give all of these fish away. So we're going to find somebody either on the way back in or off the bank. We're going to find somebody to give these fish to. So, you know, if, if I can help somebody out, I'll do it. So let's see if we can get this limit. I'm thinking we can. There he is, back to my spot. And he knocked the mess out of it. Come on, fish. I'm telling you guys, if you haven't went white bass fishing and, and you're thinking about doing it, it is some of the most, oh, that's a big one. Some of the most fun fishing there is. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big one. Look at that one. Wowza. Let's put him in here. Wowza, wowza, wowza. Where you at? There he is. Oh, we got a fighter. We got a fighter. Look at that ACC work. Look at that ACC work. Oh, we got a feisty guy. Very feisty. Look at that, that three inch grub, guys. Gone. Totally gone. Nowhere to be found. That's a good one. Oh, there he is. Oh, buddy. It's a good one. Oh, that's so fun. 
Oh, there's another one. Oh, buddy. All right, guys. Well, guess what? I think that's 15. That's 15. I've been fishing for about 20, 25 minutes. I got 15. Is there 10 more out here? Oh, there he is. Whoa. It's right underneath that. Whoa. Look at that ACC. Look at that ACC. Work for me, baby. This is a big one. Oh, yeah. For sure. Come here. Oh, that's another good one. Boom. There he is, guys. All right, that's 16. I don't know. It's looking promising. It's crazy. Oh my gosh. What is, is, is that a white bass? Don't feel like one, jeez. It is, but man, guys on steroids right here. That's a good one. That's a good one. There he is. Boom, baby. Man, that ACC do some work on these white bass, guys. Remember, this is the six foot two piece. And I really enjoy it, using it for them. But, all right, there's 17. There he is, back under my tree, baby. Look at that ACC. Look at that little six footer doing work. I hadn't even seen him yet, he's staying down. Golly, that's a good one. Oh, that is a big end, wow. Wow, wow, wow. All right, guys, well, we're getting them in there. That is number, is that 18 or 19? That's 18. It's number 18, guys. So we're close. There he is. Really? Really, you gonna make me walk over there and get that? I don't even think it's a keeper anyway. It is, it's close. Ten inches in the state of Texas, baby. Oh my gosh, it's almost twelve inches. What am I? I think those other ones are just so big. Look at that, guys. Look. Well, that's twelve inches. I, those other ones are just so big. It makes this little twelve incher look small. All right, guys. That is. 19 can we muscle out six more y'all be sure to stay tuned and find out oh there he is there he is there he is oh get out of that current oh all right guys now i'm just on the other side of where i was getting bit kind of walked in over here to the other side that tree's right here i'm on the other side of it all right, I'm gonna throw that one up on the bank. See if we can't get, an... I think we need five more, I think. All right, guys, we need five more. 
for a little limit. Oh, there he is. Oh, there he is. Kind of working it in that current a little bit. Oh, that'll work. Okay. A little male, it looks like. Look at that, three inch grub, gone. I mean, if they see it, they eat it. There's, there's no denying it. They will eat it. Look at there. I mean, even this one doesn't look that big, but it's still 12 inches. That is a 12 incher. 12 incher. 21. All right, I think I could sweat four more here at this spot. I'm hoping. Let's see what we can do. Well, guys, looking like I'm going to have to go to... Oh, well, there's one. Feels really small. Or it's a yellow bass. No, see, that's not small. What the mess? Okay, well, I don't know. That right there is going to be number 22. You know, like I said, guys, these may look small, but compared to them other ones, caught a 16 incher earlier. I mean, this is a, that's almost 13 inch white bass right there. So, so that right there is 22 three more can we get three more from this spot i really don't want to move i would like to just catch them you know one spot <laughs> okay there there's one i need to get under that tree that's kind of what i just did way out here a good one i think oh yeah it's a good one all right guys ba boom guess what that is 23 let's go see if we can get two more baby y'all stay tuned there he is there he is. All right. Where you at? All right, this is, this is 24, baby. One more. One more for a limit. Let's go. Let's go, baby. One more for a limit. That's 24. One more for a limit of white bass in Texas. There he is. There he is, guys. Is it gonna be a keeper? Feels like it's gonna be, it looks like it's gonna be a keeper. This is gonna be 25, baby. If I can get him in safely. A limit of white bass in Texas. There he is, and it's a good one to end on too. Let's go. Look at that, guys. Boom, baby, that is 25. Let's go take me too long that is 25 baby look at that i'm gonna put them on stringer be a little easier to see them but hey guys that's awesome took me less than an hour total less than an hour of actually fishing at this spot but you know what i'll be right back y'all stay tuned all right family ended the day with a limit of white bass i got those on the stringer now i'm going to show you all those here in just one minute but i want to go a little bit back more over my setup six foot two piece acc crappie sticks right here I got six pound 
mono on the Shimano Sienna 500 reel. And on this end, guys, a lot of people ask me, you know, why don't I use rooster tails or, or something flashy of that sort? And my answer to that question is you don't have to. And those rooster tails can be quite expensive nowadays. I use these three inch curly tail grubs right here from Yum. You can buy 15 of these right here for $1.75. And guess, guess how many I use today? I have a limit of white bass right here at my feet. And guys, I used four of these today. I used four of these three inch curly tail white grubs to catch a limit of white bass today. And guess what? One of those I got hung up on this tree over here and lost it. So really about three. So that is why I stick with these these are very efficient and very affordable so you can't go wrong with the, the three inch curly tail white grub but this is my setup today and y'all want to see these fish right here like i said i went ahead and put them on a stringer a little easier to organize but look at this guys look at that that right there limited white bass baby in texas some of these are really nice limited white bass baby and guess what one spot one spot took me less than an hour probably took me about 45 minutes total to actually get the limit uh once i started fishing i, pa I paddled up here about for probably about 30 minutes or so before i started actually fishing but it was a great time if you have it the white bass run of 2023 is on and popping especially in texas you guys in oklahoma missouri and the further you go north Y'all should be popping off really, really soon. I hope y'all can learn something from these white bass fishing videos. I'm gonna have a few more white bass fishing videos linked at the end of this video. Y'all be sure to go check them out. I do appreciate y'all for clicking on this video. If you haven't, go ahead and hit that like button. It really helps out the channel. And also, if you haven't, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Come join the family. We're on the road to 50,000 subscribers, like I said in the intro. I'm going to be giving away some ACC crappie sticks, some Slab City jigs, and a few other items. So if you haven't, smash that subscribe button. Come join the family. Also, if you have any questions, be sure to drop me a question in the comment section. I met a guy out here earlier, and he said he doesn't comment because he doesn't think I will reply. Guys, I'm not too big for anybody, all right? If you have any questions about the video or anything that I can help you with, drop me a comment down in the comment section. I greatly appreciate it. Like always, like, comment, and subscribe to 903 Fishing. Y'all have a great day. God bless.